From far north to the south, governors elected on the platform of the People's Democratic Party began arriving at the River State Government House, a day to their first meeting in 2022. The early visitors, comprising eight governors and some national officers of the party, are treated to a gala night by their host, Governor Nyesom Wike. Thereafter, he leads them into a closed-door meeting. Four hours later, the chairman of the PDP Governors Forum and Governor of Sokoto State, Aminu Tambawal, presents the resolutions arrived at. The PDP Governors requested the National Assembly to quickly conclude deliberations on the Electoral Act Amendment, either by overriding Mr. President veto or deleting areas of complaints. The meeting advised that the option of sustaining Mr. President's veto will lead to a quicker resolution and will deny Mr. President the opportunity to once again truncate a reformed electoral jurisprudence for Nigeria. An early concluded electoral act is vital for credible elections. The PDP governors also expressed concern about the nation's economy. The Nigerian economy has continued to deteriorate and Nigerians have become numb and accustomed to bad economic news, as exemplified by the inconsistent and differential exchange rate regime, high interest rates, unsustainable unemployment figures, and borrowing spree, some of which have not been applied to important projects. And other bad economic indicators, in particular, it is clear that the APC government is a massive failure when compared with the records of PDP in government. Governor Tambawal and his colleagues at this gathering believe that time has come for young people to participate in politics, saying that's one way the nation can rediscover itself. The meeting urged eligible Nigerians of all walks of life, particularly the youth, to register en masse with INEC to exercise their franchise in the 2023 general elections. It further noted that the next election is a very consequential election that should be used to end, it and, and, uh, to end the dominance of very youth, unfriendly APC government. The governors are, however, silent on issues bordering on their party's internal politics. But the body language from the gathering appears to indicate that the focus is on the PDP returning to power come 2023.